It's really important that, you know, you have people you can call on and people aren't just calling on you because they'll ring your damn phone all day. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And I just don't want to hear it. Like, I realize I'm going to lose a lot of friendships because I'm isolating again. And, you know, this might be on me. But the thing is, some people just come to you with their life and their problems and them, 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 them. And what they have going on and how they need this and how they need that and how they're just full of themselves, baby. Like you be sitting here really going through it. Like, I've been really, I've been fluctuating. I've been okay at points. And then other times, I just feel like it's too much to handle. It really is. And this is not a cry for help. Please do not be alarmed. But I, I just, I just, I'm peeping what I need to peep for real, for real. And I know. So I can't even be surprised. I can only be upset with myself for not listening to my intuition. Earlier, I got people talking about, you know, I'm glad for my partner. He has stepped it up to an extent like he's slowly breaking bad habits and stuff like that he's going to school he's been working really hard and he was talking about how if he gets on the road as a trucker he could bring somebody with him aka me and i'm like listen i love that for you i'm happy for you but i'm not chasing nobody else's dreams i fucked up with that a while ago and especially if you ain't paying none of my bills baby i pay my own way i still have a life to live i still got stuff to do so why would i sacrifice what i got going on to come you know be by your side and you're showing when you're by my side you can't even look out i can't even ask some people around me for five dollars if i needed it and it's fine if you don't have it but <sighs> sorry y'all my bad i'm good though for real like i'm not even kidding look at my keys it's a little shit that makes me happy like i've been meaning to change these out before it was i got this in thailand from a friend I'm still gonna keep it, but it was, you know, this matches my room too, which is pretty cool. Yeah, my TV's back in my room. I have a mini fridge, so anything I get from the store is going to be in my room. I don't care. Yes, I'm putting groceries in my room. No, it is not a point of you're not gonna eat with me because if I eat, you eat, but people can't even make sure I eat and they got the means to help. So it's just good to know I'm peeping it, you know, and I'm gonna just take care of myself and I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna have to work and grind. So basically my car stopped working. I went to go do my family a favor at one of the rental properties and shit. And my car just had a big oil stain under it and would not start. So that happened and it's a little disappointing because I'm still paying down like $1,200 worth of car maintenance for the brakes and oil change I just got and a whole bunch of other stuff. So car issues was the last thing I thought was gonna happen. I don't know what's wrong with it. It's parked in front of somewhere safe right now, which is cool, but that's the last thing I thought I would have to worry about. So I'm literally stuck in the house and people are finding solutions. And you know, it's crazy how it's like my car will get fucked up and the first thing is, oh my gosh, how am I supposed to get to where I need to go? And it's like, how am I supposed to get where I need to go? It's my car. I'm glad I work from home and I have the ability to make money virtually, but damn. And as y'all just saw, I was getting really tired of the sex work uh, and the virtual work as well. So now I, you know, it's forced my hand. I have to be here. I'm about to stock up on some tree because we ain't doing this sober. I'm about to stock up on my favorite foods and my healthy foods too. I'm about to be working out. I'm about to be watching TV. I'm about to mind my business. I'm about to be behind closed doors for probably the rest of this lease, to be honest, because that's just where we're at. I need to think straight without outside influence, without being in love. Cause if this is what love looks like, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it, it feels good. But if I end up feeling like I shouldn't have given myself to a person, whether that's emotionally, sexually, financially, spiritually, physically, whatever it is. Like if I end up feeling regretful with you, that's not good. That's not good. It's really not. Like if I don't know if I want to be with you, cause I don't even know if you could be the person I need to be with for real, for real. To be successful and i'm successful within myself Psh, but it's all good because the thing is i'm dangerous when i lock down at work so i feel like this is supposed to hold me back like oh haha ha, you're stuck in the house not even haha ha, i don't think anyone's laughing at me i'm not like paranoid like that i just think it's kind of like oh damn that's unfortunate well we gonna go do what we need to do you don't have anything else to offer anymore so now that i'm stuck in the house i'm like it's good because when i lock down i'm dangerous baby all my work is virtual and within the house. I should have been sitting in the house doing my work. And it sucks because it's September right now. The weather is perfect. I would love to still take myself on cute little dates. I would love to go check out some cool stuff for the vlogs and for myself and enjoy. But I got some cool people I know that could pick me up. And yeah, it's all good. But a car is a lot. <laughs> Not having a car is a lot too. So that's where we're at. 
and it's all good we're gonna prevail I'm, I'm inspired i'm hurt i'm very hurt but i'm inspired i know not to make the same mistakes next year that's important too so yeah we're gonna lock down we're gonna try to get to 100k on instagram we are going to try to get to a thousand followers we're almost halfway there on youtube we're gonna try to start monetizing on all the platforms we can and we're just gonna be a virtual dream babe like a virtual fantasy dream babe keep working out like i'm a lock in i'm a lock in no distractions i'm locked in it's good but i'm gonna remember this i'm gonna remember this when everybody was thinking about themselves i'm gonna remember how i thought about myself and i put myself first finally i do it sometimes but not nearly enough I started a little bit yesterday. I worked on some really cool vlogs and it's Friday right now. So I'm about to get up. People got paid. I'm, I'm pumped. Let's shake some ass. Let's post on the snap. Let's post on the YouTube and we're going to get this up. Y'all not going to see this at the time I post this, of course, but I'm going to get to a point where I do catch up and, you know, get more consistent. I'll probably order some groceries. My dad doesn't even like stay near me. So the fact that he's willing to come and give me food is really nice. Damn, that hurts. That really hurts. <laughs> now me over here buying 2K when it released the day, but oh, I'm sorry, pre-ordering 2K as an early birthday gift. And because, you know, people was going through a lot emotionally and there's just been a lot of wild stuff happening, death, accidents, like some stuff's been going down, y'all. Life has not been playing. My family just got in a car accident right after I just got in a car accident. And both times it was the other person's fault. Like, not me over here buying 2K for people and I can't even get somebody to, oh, I, I can't, I can't. I'm not gonna say that, I'm not gonna be dramatic. I can't, but I can't even look to the same people to try to get some groceries. Like, I'm not gonna forget that. And I had to ask a couple times, a few times actually, and that's too close to begging for me. I'll be out here feeding people, but I can't even get the resources to feed in the first place. It's all really good. It's all really good, for real, for real. I'm glad I was wilding out this summer. I was still respectful. I was not doing anything crazy or sexual or whatever, but I just had fun. I had a really, really fun, exciting summer. I see how people move. I see how people kind of just, I see the vibes people be on. I see some people still want to secretly be mean or try to tear you down. I see that some people just want to use you for whatever. And at the end of the day, I'm sorry, people suck. <laughs> Myself included, people suck. As human beings, we have a lot of healing to do myself included i'm not excluding myself i'm not gonna be on this i hate everybody rampage no people suck we have work to do we are traumatized <laughs> like we have so much inner work to do and if you're working on the inner work that is beautiful and keep it up because you're doing great seriously you're doing great just try to self-awareness is so important and yeah just consideration and not being full of yourself and you know but it's all good. It's really all good. I've been selling snaps. I have been trying to keep my energy up. I've been protecting and reserving my energy too. I'm letting less people come to me with their problems as well. Because people got a lot of problems and so do I. But I'm also going to people less about my problems. Because I see when I have problems, it's a problem. But when they have problems, I'm just supposed to listen and help and provide solutions. Which sucks. So that being said, I'm about to order some groceries. Shout out to my dad once again for saving the day. I've gotten so much closer with my dad. Like my family relationship and dynamics have changed and it's just crazy. Like I never thought this shift would come, but like I've gotten a lot closer with my dad. He's cool as shit and yeah, but he's been looking out and helping. He's been a great example of what I'm trying to work towards and I don't know if he knows about my work or not, but I know he knows I'm trying and that's what's important. And yeah, I do this for myself and my family. And I want to say my friends, but the friend list is getting shorter and shorter, y'all. It really is. People be showing their true colors. <laughs> they be painting a whole motherfucking picture. So yeah, but that being said, that's all I wanted to say. Thank y'all for giving me the space to listen again. I'm going to be A-O motherfucking K. Your girl got her TV back. Because why am I sacrificing my TV so we can all vibe in a room and the vibes aren't even there? Like, why am I... I'm about to be in here binge watching stuff again getting inspired working on art camming all of it and working out still eating well and i'm gonna just have to be a homebody and i know that it sucks having to be in the house right now until i can get my car fixed but i know next year when i'm on whatever island i'm on again <laughs> i ain't gonna be worried about a damn thing plus i don't even want to go out right now 
so yeah but that being said thank y'all so much for watching this is probably not the end of the vlog i'll probably you know throw in some cool stuff in here so y'all aren't completely depressed by what i'm saying <laughs> um but nah thank you for allowing me to stay seriously i got my switch i got good vibes like we're good we're good we're good <laughs> but yeah thank y'all so much seriously um and i guess next transition what's up y'all after spending the entire day trying to finagle and finesse some groceries and no i don't mean it like that obviously i'm paying for them but i was trying to figure out financing apps and calculate my money in the second and third i just went ahead and paid for them outright because your girl's been selling her snaps okay every day i post on the hub i post my snap i got a system so that every day i try to hit a hundred dollars anyways it was a lot and i'm just really grateful for groceries i've said this before it just it put a lot in perspective but i've got a nice little juicy ass order coming in tomorrow and i'm going to go to the gym after that and i'm gonna just be grateful work my ass off even more because i never want to be in this position again i'll talk to y'all later wonder woman sure is because i'm wondering how i'm getting this done